So tell us about your character. <laughs> Um, you're hearing a lot that he's a bad guy, which is, he is a bad guy. Um, he, but I say that because uh, it's much more complex than that. He's not your typical bad guy. Um, in this occupying uh, event, the arrival when everything has completely been blown, not literally, but uh, everyone's lives have been turned upside down and blown to pieces. Um, my character emerges as somebody in charge of the Los Angeles block. Um, through any means necessary, probably, he was able to uh, suck his way up to the top and uh, was somebody willing to make the kind of decisions that uh, many others wouldn't have made and sacrifice others and, uh, you know, found himself in a position to uh, stay alive and stay alive in a healthy and wealthy way. That's my character. Um, the, when we were talking before to uh, uh, we were talking about it sort of being allegorical for like Vichy France and that sort of collaborative stuff. Is it you see the show as more of a near future kind of political thriller, even more than sci fi? Well, I don't know. It's got all of it. I think all of it well balanced. As well. I don't think it's one or the other. Certainly, the inspiration for it in a way was was the you know, how do people respond in an occupied time? And that's something that we don't know in this country. Um, you know, we have shades of tragedy where we can imagine what it's like. Um, you know, some have experienced, you know, something happening in a moment when all of a sudden you're not, you know, your life is no longer what it was. Um, and that, that doesn't, that has not happened to us in mass. Yet. Yet. Never. Good God. I'm not predicting anything. Um, but, uh, so in that way it's hugely political and that it is about, you know, who's in charge, who has, who, who has things, who does not, who's willing to step on somebody else to get on top, what are you willing to do if you're at the bottom to, you know, find your way back to some kind of normalcy. Um, and the sci-fi stuff I think is almost in the background and that's, that's fine. We have, you know, there's a lot of sci-fi out there, there's a lot of action, there's a lot of destruction, there's a lot of weapons, there's a lot of attack. That stuff will come in this, but the thrust is, I think, more human and political in nature.